Shinra personnel, we are now arriving at Costa del Sol. As per new order by Rufus Shinra, all employees are allowed to bring back one souvenir, and no, women do not count, you pigs. It's 0007, guys. Get with the program. So that's what happened. Sephiroth fades through the ground, flew away, and left a Genova monster for us to fight. So was it? It was not hot. That's subjective. What's your nose telling us, Red? Well, I do detect the faint scent of corpses in tragic backstories. But I mean, that could be anyone, right? Yes. Anyone. What should we do? There's only one thing we really can do. Let's- Let's the Devolution! Come on, guys. We need a break. It's been a long journey for all of us. You just showed up. And already I'm making your lives better. That's subjective. Well, we are ahead of Shinra. I guess there's nothing wrong with taking a break. Yes. But how can a man take a break? from his own past. Man, it's scorching out here! Right, Tifa? <gasps> we should hang out! Oh, you wanna hang out? Sure, let's go to the bar. Oh, I can't go there. I left my fake ID and the other pair of pants I stole. Oh, that's a shame. Guess I'll just have to drink for the both of us. Ugh, lame. Just you wait, Tifa. You and I are gonna hang out and it's gonna be epic, yo! You for yo! I wonder where she goes when she does that. Easy, easy. Oh, God! Yep, looks like my ride is here. <laughs> And what a magnificent ride it is, sir. Uh, let's walk and talk cards. I've got places to be. Now, this may come as a surprise to you. It certainly has for me. But I must say, you have really come into your own as head of social media. Oh, I feel so hashtag blessed. Speaking of hashtags, do you know what the top trend I found was? It was... Hashtag, did it not occur to you that instead of live walking these events, you could have, oh, I don't know, done anything to capture those intruders on my ship? Well, I don't think a hashtag that long would track that well. I will give you a second chance, Hadka. But understand that if a fiasco like this happens again, you will lose both your jobs. Do I make myself clear? Yes, but... Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. Hmm. Very good. Well, I believe that was quite the effective pep talk. Oh, I certainly hope whatever Hadika does yields results. Ah! I believe this whole ordeal has earned me a trip to Gold Saucer. You know who I should have invited? Private Thunderhead. Now there's a soldier who blows expectations. Hey, guys, I found a bomb. Woo! All right, sports! <laughs> yeah, all right! Hey, Red, <laughs> Yuffie was right. We really did need to unwind. Yeah, sounds like everyone's having a good time. Okay, guys, this is a drink I call the Roundhouse Blitz. Now, what you're going to want to do is take your closest bottle of whiskey and keep fitting me shots till I say when. You will say when, right? Hey, let's talk more for I'm really worried about my bestest friend. Barrett has been acting pretty weird since we got here. I haven't seen him all day. Mmm, that's right. Big Daddy Barrett coming at you live from Love City. Population, me and your fine-ass self, mama. Ah, he's probably having some Barrett time. I remember when we used to have avalanche time. Maybe the flower girl has seen him. Now that you mention it, I haven't seen Aerith around either. Why don't you ask the ninja and it? The... What? Oh, that's my name for the ninja girl. It's a combination of the words ninja and bandit. Because she's a materia thief. Yuffie is not a materia thief. Welcome to Yuffie's used materia shop. Wanna buy anything? I got a lightning one with your name on it. I'm good. Why are you selling materia anyway? Because I'm bored and Tifa won't let me in the bar. Why do you want to hang out with her anyway? Because she's so cool. We've like got the perfect chemistry with each other. You mean the kind of chemistry that makes explosions? Cha, explosions rock. I actually wanted to ask, have you seen Aerith? Hmm, I did see her on the beach talking to some dude in a lab coat while I was setting up shop with my sweet ninja carpentry skills. A lab coat? <laughs> what kind of weirdo would wear that to the beach? Dr. Hojo, 
I'm surprised to see you haven't combusted in the sun like a vampire yet. Oh, you'd be surprised what vampires can do nowadays. <laughs> what the hell are you even doing here, Hojo? No. Oh. Isn't it obvious? Ever since I resigned from Shinra, I decided to take a little vacation. I see your friend has the right idea. You got to right now, bro! Cost the delcation! The job is to win, but the win never came! We're not just here on a vacation, Hojo. We're on a mission to find and take down Sephiroth. Once and for all. My, my. Such unwavering tenacity. I just hope you have more confidence in killing Sephiroth than you do with picking up women. What? I, 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 I am so good at picking up ladies. So, uh, do you like movies? Hi, Papi. That's a pretty good giant hunk of metal on a stick you got there. It's called a buster sword! So what do you all want? I was having such a delightful conversation with Etcetera until you all interrupted. He knows the same fairy tales as my mom. How is Ifana doing? That's not my mom's name. Oh, trust me, it is. I knew your real mother quite intimately. <laughs> That's enough, Hojo. Come on, guys, vacation's over. Let's start asking around about Sephiroth. Well, if it's information you want, I have heard mumblings of a man in a black cape heading towards Gold Saucer. Just keep going west, and I'm sure you'll all find what you're looking for. Right, Big Daddy Barrett? That name is reserved for all the sweet-ass mamas of the world, Hojo! Speaking of which, how the hell are you surrounded by all these beautiful ladies? Well, I found them on the Shintranet. They said they were up for experimentation. <laughs> You're still paying us, right? You can leave now. Hey, Aerith, that stuff Hojo said about your mom. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Tifa, on the other hand. Costa Delcation! Guys, I want so much materia from Yuffie. I'm gonna be so powerful. Oh my god, that hangover is gonna hit you like a truck. Hey, hey, let's 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 talk for real quick, okay? Yuffie, I, I just I just want to say that I'm so sorry I knocked you out the first time we met. Oh, that's all right. Even though you totally deserved it, and you like annoy the. Ton out of me, but like, you remind me a lot, like, of me. You're like a little sister to me. What? I say you like a little sister, babe. And like, I say half shit. I have you back no matter what. Do you know what? You know what? You know what? We're gonna have a fucking plastic gold saucer. We're gonna go on and rewrite. <gasps> really, Tifa? You promise? Del Sol. Such a role model. We're almost there, friends. My nose is telling me that the quickest way to Gold Saucer is to go through these mountains that smell like coal. Coal, coal, coal. Hey, y'all, peep this idea. How about instead of doing that, we go a completely different route, huh? But my nose says this. I don't want to go through goddamn Bell Corral, okay? Hmm. Barrett, stop yelling at Red. What's gotten into you, man? You've been acting weird ever since we got off the boat. Ah. I'm sorry, y'all. It's just that there are things that I've done here that I thought I left behind. But I suppose a man can never truly outrun his past. I just need to know if y'all are ready to delve with me into the darkness that is my soul. To help me take that plunge, are you prepared? Barrett? I'm prepared for anything. I wasn't prepared for this! Now, stop being a baby and jump! All right! One, two, three! Ow! Behold, y'all, the remnants of my past. Wow, this place is a dump. 
Like a train ran through it or something. I'm gonna need y'all to wait here for a minute. I need to take care of something. Well, if you need anything, we're right here. You all right, Red? No, I'm worried about him. Nah, don't worry about Barrett. He can handle himself. Ooh. Well, shit. You got some nerve showing your face around here, baby. Look, I'm just passing through with my friends, okay? I, I don't want any trouble. Oh, well, that's too bad, baby, because wherever your ass goes, trouble always seems to follow. Tell you what, baby, we'll let you and those bull suckers you're dragging around pass on one condition. We want you to say something. Uh, all right, then. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, baby, you know what we want to hear. <sighs> I fucked up. Baby, you ain't even worth it. So... You're gonna tell us what that was all about? Why were those twins and that fat guy saying such mean things? Because I deserve it. My hometown used to be around here. What do you mean, used to? I've constructed a narrative cloud! Shut your ass up! I used to live in a small mine in town, called Corel. It was calm and peaceful, until Shinra showed up. Giant baby, your ass needs to understand that Shinra buying our coal mines to put up a Mako reactor is the best thing to ever happen to us. Why the hell are you against it? Because it's the coal, man! We've been using coal to run this town for generations. Do you know what we're doing to our town if we give all that away to these snakes from Shinra? Golly gosh, Dad, I think having a Mako reactor would be a peach keen swell idea. Your incredibly rugged and attractive friend is right, Dime. Having a Mako reactor will finally drag your town out of the dark, grimy, lung cancerous coal mines of the past and into the bright, glistening future of Mako energy. Doesn't that just get you excited, Mr. Wallace? Oh my, well ma'am, Mr. Wallace was my father's name, and I don't think my dying wife would approve of your advances towards me. Oh darling, like marriage has ever stopped anyone from cheating before. But, but the coal, man! Dine, darling, please, you have my word. With Shinra on your side, your lives can only get better. All I'm asking from the both of you is to simply Give us a hand. But... Cool, man. After that, the reactor was built within the week. And everyone was happy. So how long did that last? Ah! Yours too, huh? The reactor exploded. Shinra blamed the people of Corel, so in retaliation, they... They burned everything to the ground. Dan and I were out of town while it happened. That was four years ago. I lost everything. Barrett, I... I had no idea. But hey, at least you still have your daughter Marlene, right? My... my da da daughter... Marlene, gotcha. Come on, guys, Sephiroth's waiting. Yeah. Let's just head up to the happiest goddamn place on the planet. Wow. I never knew. Red, did you know about this? No, nope, girl. I never knew. My bestest friend has another bestester friend. Look, guys, I think the best thing right now is to just give him some space and not annoy him. We're all going to the gold saucer! We are going! We are going to the gold saucer! We're all going to the gold saucer! I'm going to fucking kill her.